Yeah, but you do search heaps of porn. Yeah, well, I mean... There's a correlation there, my friend. Yeah, they know, I, they're like, he likes music, and but, he loves... Yeah, but I only so search... Nudity. Yeah, I only want, like, pornography with metal. <laughs> metal porn. I don't need metal porn. Yeah. There was... Isn't that a... Oh, I'm going to forget this, because my friend's sister got accepted to be one. They were like an alt model... Oh, Suicide Girls. That's it. There you go. There's your... I remember them from back in the day. Are they still going? I remember them from the back in the day, he says. I look at their <laughs> favourites list. <laughs> Good morning, party people. Welcome to the breakdown with, with Nathan, Nathan and Johnny. Johnny. Uh, I, I know just... what you're thinking. Is... You're thinking, coming here all the time. Oh, it hurts. <laughs> I just... I, I was a bit concerned because we were like talking about porn just then and you said coming here. And I was like, oh God, where's he going with this? Channel's going to get cancelled. I'm not you. You need to remember that. But... Your I want to bet butts again. Classic Johnny. <laughs> Jiggling butt. You're a little bit more influenced by my crass nature and stupidity than you would like to admit. I don't agree. I do. I you think... have made you have made a few titty and penis jokes on the channel? No, I just called you a dick, you tit. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Headphone clap! Uh, today we're checking out the brand new track from Anna Shikari, It Hurts. It's not actually that brand new, it came out a week ago, and again, we've been holding off because we like to give you guys genuine reactions. Yep. So, this I believe is a follow on, particularly judging by the start of the clip here, from the last track we checked out, uh, yeah. Please Set Me On Fire. Cool, let's go. I'm just keen to get into it. I, okay. I'm just really loving what they're dropping. Uh, and you guys are going to drop your hands straight onto that like and subscribe button. What? You don't need to tell them to like and subscribe for every video. That's a bad time. Yeah, it's cool. It's really well done. Uh, I want to say, the older he gets, the more he looks like a Bond villain. Okay. It's just because we're in a black trench coat? Yeah, maybe. But, like, I don't know, like, the demeanour and the hair and everything, he looks villainous. But I... you wouldn't expect it, you know? You I know, don't agree with you on this be, one. No, there'd be I a twist. I know what you're trying to go for. There'd be a twist. I think you're just literally looking at a dark <laughs> overcoat and going, yeah, he's evil. But he's walking through there looking very shifty, you know what I mean? He's like looking he's... confused. You would too, mate. I really like 
much, Robert. I tell you off for that all the time. Uh, I saw in an interview with Rao, who's saying that he's really enjoying playing with the production of the vocals a lot and actually, yeah, like, playing with the sound and the tones and stuff with them in the production. Like they're running through something and... Yeah. My dog's hair was on your chin. Okay. Um, worth it. He's so worth it. He's so got to snuggle. Yeah, which I think you can hear in the single so far. It hasn't just been his vocals the whole way through. One, all three of them are singing a lot, which they do on the albums, but you can hear different sort of filters being run through them, which I think is really interesting and adding a cool dynamic. Yeah, yeah. I um, When you look at Rao in that, where it's just the four of them standing there, he looks like he could have played like young Elton John on Rocket Man with those glasses. I'm going to pay attention to that now. I um, also want to point out when Chris was on screen before in a green coat, you didn't say anything about being a Bond villain then. Because it's green, man. Exactly. You were calling just the coat, not him. You idiot. Agrees with me. Oh, God. to not go back to that um unless you felt the inevitable you never know if it truly was mm. profound uh yeah trust it to not go to that that view of all four of them oh yeah after you said that yeah mother f- also just let's go back to the fact that you were like he looks like a bond villain i claimed mm. it's because of the jacket you're like no and then i go to a green jacket you're like yeah see it's green oh <laughs> yeah. No, but it's like, it's, oh. it's less, uh, I guess it's less, I don't know. Dark and brooding? Villainy. Yeah, well, that was my whole point. You were literally just commenting on the black coat, not him as a person. Mm. And you're a dumb No, 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 I stand by it. I he stand was, by it. He was going to be the green villain. Oh, I thought he was going to be okay. the green villain, yeah, and you wouldn't see it coming. I'm pretty sure I said that about the black coat as well. But yeah. anyway, uh, I like how... The last video we checked out was quite simplistic. Like it was, are you having fun here? <laughs> you trying to justify yourself? <laughs> and I can see even you don't quite believe it. No, yeah, no, no. <laughs> that's, that's my entire life, man. Like <laughs> you got this, dude. Um, no, it was like the last music video, although done really well, was very simplistic. And I like how this one just went starting from there, and the same sort of aesthetic, but just went. Oh, look at all this cool Yeah, shit chaos here. ensues. Yeah. Because I kind of expected them to do like a Memphis May Fire TV room thing where they would oh, just keep the okay. common theme. But no, that was really cool. I like that. And I really like the song. It's very catchy. I like how the chorus opened up a little bit at the end as well and, and changed a bit. It was good. Very catchy. It's got me so excited for the album because I feel, yeah. as we said on the last single, I feel like they're really utilising different elements of their back catalogue yeah. to create something that's so in a Shikari but still unique and new. Yeah, for sure. Like, like I said, like it, it, those, like that almost breakdowny bit sort of gave me flash flood of color vibes. And, yeah. Um, and, you know, like I, I think the, I loved the last album, but I think they're really onto something here with just taking a few of those elements from the older stuff and throwing them in. What did you guys think? What do you think about the fact that Johnny has leaves his headphones after in, after watching now? That's his new thing. <laughs> That's, that's it's, been, it's Monday. That's part of what I was laughing at before. Oh, is it? And I was like, oh, no, it's been a long day. I won't say anything. It's it's like, yeah, it's, why is he yelling? <laughs> you know what happened? We would have finished recording, then you would have got up and walked away, still attached, probably. And I would have just like pulled, it it, pulled been everything up the so table. funny. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. thanks for being here. We love you. We think you're incredible. You are going to do great things. Peace.